Good morning again, everyone. Ann Martin Fry here, founder and CEO of Homeless to Independence, Inc. And I have some more employment. And this is on the West Coast, California. I have a lot. But I'm going to give you what I got ready right now. I'm, I'm in the weeds again. Uh, that's the way it goes. So hang in there, folks. All right. Just bear with me. Bear with me. Thanks. Uh, first, I want to welcome everyone, all our new subscribers here on YouTube. And then we have uh, new um, followers on other platforms that this video uh, podcast also gets uploaded to. We're also on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Pinterest, Instagram, Alignable, Yelp, Gab, BitChute, and we're also now on Patreon. So you can even follow us and support us on Patreon. We're all set up there too, and I've been already uploading things to um, my tier levels there. So uh, please uh, join us over on Patreon. Uh, for as little as $3 a month to support us. And we really appreciate that. So let me get this employment done for you folks. For California, Pep Boys in Oxnard needs an engine performance technician. Penny Mac in Roseville needs a home loan specialist. One customer contact. The Geo Group in Atalanto... Adelanto needs a chaplain assistant. The Geo Group in Susanville needs a substance abuse counselor. Suez uh, Water Technologies and Solutions in San Diego needs an account manager. The Geo Group in San Bernardino needs a case manager. Um, the Geo Group again in Adelanto needs a lieutenant. I'm sure that is um, law enforcement. The Geo Group again in Andalanto needs a janitor. Um, the Pep Boys in Lake Forest needs a store manager for service of service. Oogelnik Development LLC in San Diego has uh, two positions. One is for a shipping receiving clerk and the second is for quality control specialist QC. Geo Group again in Adelanto needs an officer, mental health, and Geo Group in Salinas, California needs a client services specialist. All right, got some more. On call staffing solutions. Now, I usually don't do the staffing companies, but I did this one. Um, and Anaheim needs a H-E-L-O-C supervisor. And then Ogilnick again in San Diego needs a stock clerk. Hico Companies in Azusa needs a mech design engineer. Penny Mac in Roseville needs a home loan specialist one. Ogilnick Developments again in San Diego needs a warehouse specialist A inventory. I don't think that's supposed to be in there. The Geo Group in Merced needs a JRP transitional case manager. HITT contracting in Santa Clara needs an office manager. They also need a commercial construction assistant project manager. And they also need a commercial construction superintendent. And then the Geo Group in El Centro needs a case management coordinator. And that's what I have for California at the moment. Of course, you can find all of these on Homeless to Independence's California Employments page. Anybody looking for an online virtual career fair? fair? A lot of companies online at one time that you can even chat with the hiring managers and ask questions and even apply online. I have you covered. Homeless to Independence has them all updated and they are um, on our recent updates page through either the 4th or 5th of May. Also, anybody that has a speckled pass, anybody that has a felony and or misdemeanor conviction of any type, um, we also work with those um, 
employment opportunities, email me, please. Uh, and this also is open for probation officers, parole officers, social workers in soup kitchens, clothing closets, food pantries, halfway houses, half back houses, shelters, and job clubs. So reach out to me, Anne at homeless to independence.org. In the subject line, please put the word speckled. And then in the body of the email, just put the name of your state, commonwealth, or territory. This information I'm speaking on is also down below. So you don't have to like go keep going back and forth for the email address. Homeless to Independence is an all-volunteer 501c3 nonprofit. And we do not receive any federal or state grant funding. We still haven't received anything from the EIDL. We do not qualify for the PPP because we are a volunteer with no salaries to pay. Um, all of our fundraising is virtually done and down right now because of this COVID-19. And we really need help because our bills are still mounting just like a lot of other other um, small businesses or other organizations that are all volunteer. So please support us, help us out. Next week on Tuesday, May 5th, Homeless to Independence is going to be involved with that Giving Tuesday now and more information for that is coming out. I want to take a moment and say thank you so very much to all everybody that has purchased something from our charity vetted eBay store. And um, I get everything the next day um, shipped out. So uh, we're really grateful. And you can check us out on eBay. And that link is also down below. 100% of, of the purchase price is donated to Homeless to Independence. And it does state that on every single one of our listings. And that money goes into our vetted charity PayPal account. We are a member of the PayPal Giving Fund, and then the funds are then transferred into Homeless to Independence's nonprofit operational bank account, and the bills are paid. So we appreciate everything. And I, honestly, personally, I have not even received my stimulus. So we're really hurting. Homeless to Independence is suffering substantially due to this because all our venues are, are closed. Um, pretty much. I mean, they are closed. So anybody that can give us a hand, see what we have to sell on there and purchase it, that would be your way of helping out. We really appreciate that. So uh, with that, I'm going to close out this uh, podcast and say, please like, hit that like button, subscribe and share. Have a great day.